Uh, this lecture is rather a very introductory lecture to Chinese Buddhism, Taoism, and uh, Confucianism. I think they are uh, very important to Chinese people and also to people of uh, Western countries as well, because as we know, uh, the European countries, American countries, uh, sometimes you know they have entered a kind of crisis of uh, culture, uh, culture of mentality and they need some kind of Eastern philosophy, Eastern religion to deliver themselves out of this uh, cultural crisis, right? As Nietzsche has said, you know, God is dead. And so a lot of people in Western countries, America or European countries, they are materialistically very, you know, satisfying. But their spirit, you know, is, uh, is not that, you know, uh, satisfying to themselves. They need a kind of a moral standard or kind of spiritual pursuit, which I think can only or can very often be found in Chinese religions, especially Buddhism. Buddhism is a religion or I say a, a teaching which can make people live truly freely and without worries and uh, cares you know achieving the transcendental buddha's wisdom it can help us a lot in our daily life being comforting us when we are in mental troubles or any other kind of uh, disasters in any way uh, buddhism uh, Taoism, they can help everybody in this world to achieve what they want. And that's what I'm going to say about this lecture. Thank you. Can you say a few words for Friday Chopsticks? We are... uh, Friday Chopsticks, what, what kind of organization is it again? Um, it's a radio, student radio. It's and a this student is our radio. program, Friday Chopsticks, and oh. this is the program for Eastern culture. Oh, yes. that's a very wonderful radio program. And you know, I was teaching uh, Chinese uh, Buddhist culture in Beijing Foreign Studies University to students uh, like you, you know, at this age. Even though they are Chinese, they don't have so much knowledge about uh, Buddhism, and uh, they are very much interested in it. And a lot of students were engaged in, in my class, and uh, they say a lot of their problems were solved after listening to the lecture uh, about their interpersonal relationships with their roommates or classmates and their troubles and problems in their life and career and their dreams and so on and uh, this is an another way to look at themselves to look at uh, the world maybe we can open a third eye to see this universe and our existence and our life can be transformed and reformed by the Buddha's teaching which I think is very much needed today in this materialistic worldly world and for final you can say something for good luck for our listeners yeah so for the listeners of the radio program I hope this radio program can bring you wisdom and uh, good luck in your um, understanding of the world, in your understanding of Eastern culture, which can be made very helpful to the growth of young people, both physically and uh, psychologically and culturally. And I think this program must be, you know, a very nice program, which is needed by everybody to know Eastern culture. Thank you.